Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a booty building workout. We're gonna get straight into it. So grab an exercise band and lie on a mat or towel, whatever you've got, or the carpet, I don't know. And we'll get started. Ready? With the adductor press to frog leg raise and go. So push the legs apart, that's the adductor press. Squeeze the glutes and lift the legs up and lower back down. Press, squeeze, lift and lower. Press, squeeze, lift and lower. So you wanna keep your heels together um, and then as you push the legs apart, you're really working the adductors and that puts you in a great position to get a good glute squeeze. You wanna to aim to bring the hips up off the mat so that your body is in a straight line from shoulder to hip to knee. So pushing the knees as far apart as you can while keeping the hips together, squeezing at the top. Keep going, you guys, you're doing really well. This is only five minutes, but it's gonna burn. That's what we're here for, to work. You see, you gotta work, work and rest. Well done, 15 seconds rest. Then we're gonna go in with the prone bent leg lift. So lying on our front, we're gonna leave the band on and we're just gonna lift up that leg. Ready? and go so lifting the leg up off the ground now the trick to this is that you want to keep both hips on the ground okay i don't want you rolling over or anything so the movement is actually very small it's a very small angle it might be limited by your flexibility in the quads and that's okay we're just gonna pulse it here so push up as high as you can squeezing the glutes keep going you should get a bit of resistance from the band if you're not getting much resistance you can push the band up a little bit higher or adjust it as you need to keep going squeezing lifting up but keeping those hips on the mat doing so well and rest well done i was just going to do the same thing but on the other leg <laughs> How are you feeling guys? You okay? I'm good, thank you for asking, that's so sweet of you. Ready and go. So pushing up, as though there's something on like your foot of the bent leg and you're just trying to like push it up or push up towards the ceiling. Really squeezing the glutes, keeping a nice good tight core. Your head can be like however is comfortable but we're keeping pushing, really lifting that leg up, getting a great glute squeeze and lifting up as high as we can without picking the hips up off the mat. So just going for that full extension. Keep going, 10 more seconds. You're doing so, so well, absolutely smashing it. And rest, well done. Then we're gonna come back over onto our back for some hip raises. So feet in towards the bottom and pressing the knees apart or keeping the band on. And we're gonna lift the hips all the way up with the feet flat on the mat, ready and go. So you wanna keep a nice tight core, good position, good posture, and we're gonna squeeze the glutes as we lift up. So you want the feet fairly flat on the ground. I mean, you can be on your heels a bit, um, but they are right up into the bottom. So we're targeting the glutes that way instead of the hamstrings. And you want to lift all the way up so the body's in a straight line from shoulder through to hip, through to knee at the top. We're still pressing apart against that band. Do not let the knees fall in. You're doing so well. You can turn the feet out a little bit. Just really targeting the glutes. You're doing so, so well. Keep going. And in five seconds, what we're gonna do is we're not gonna rest. We're gonna keep going, but with a pulsing movement and go. So keep pulsing at the top, squeezing, staying nice and high. You can do it. We're gonna finish off this five minute workout with a one minute pulse. You're doing so, so well. I want you to intentionally get that mind to muscle connection. So not passive about it. You can even be passive in this life. You've gotta be intentional. Keep squeezing, you're doing so, so well. Hips nice and high not letting the knees fall in, pushing them apart. Just 30 more seconds, well done, you're halfway there. Halfway there, oh wait, no, that's the wrong lyrics. Wow, that was, that was embarrassing for me. Keep going, you're doing so, so well. Squeeze every time you feel like you wanna quit, just keep pushing through. 10 more seconds, lift those hips up. 
breathe through it. Five, four, three, two, one. And hold and release. Well done, you guys. Ah, oh, done. You did it. You done, done, did it. The five minute workout. So now we're just going to stretch it out. So just crossing that leg over the body, um, or, over, or rather in front of the body. Just going to feel the stretch in the glutes. You can lift up the other legs, just intensify that stretch, and then switch on to the other side. It's pushing down the knee, just lifting the leg closest to the body, then we're going to sit up, cross one leg over, and look, look back at it, look back at the front door. Just feeling that stretch again, it's so, so good to stretch after a workout. Really great for recovery and keeping good mobility in root prevention. And turn the other way. Well done guys, absolutely smashed it. I'm really proud of you, how did you find that? Let me know in the comments. Um, I'm so proud of you for doing that with me. Um, you can always repeat that two to four times is what I usually recommend depending on where you're at. Thank you so much for joining me. I will see you guys next time. Love you so much.